I'm the calculus professor and today we'll be talking about working with integrals. In problem number 23, I'd like to find the average value of the function f of x is equal to 1 over x squared plus 1 on the interval from negative 1 to 1. Okay, so how do we find an average value? Uh, sometimes the notation for this is f with a bar over it for the average value. Um, but the way that we calculate this thing is we take the integral from negative 1 to 1 of this function, but then we're going to multiply that by 1 over the length of the interval. If you'd prefer, you could say b minus a. But really, it's just the length of this interval. We can see that the length of that interval is 2. So this is just going to be a 2. But if you prefer, it's b, which is 1, minus a, which is negative 1. You can see that 1 minus minus 1 is 2. And that's just the length of this interval. OK, so what we get here is we get this is just 1 over 2 times uh, the antiderivative of 1 over x squared plus 1, we know that that is tan inverse of x. And we're going to evaluate that from minus 1 to 1. So we still have that 1 half out front. And then we are going to plug in 1, and we're going to plug in minus 1. So we get tan inverse of 1 minus tan inverse of negative 1. <clears throat> okay, so we still have that 1 half. Tan inverse of 1, in other words, the tangent of what angle gives me 1, and the answer is pi over 4, minus uh, tan inverse of minus 1. In other words, tangent of what angle gives me negative 1, and the answer is negative pi over 4. Uh, and so what do we get out of this thing? We get a 1 half times pi over 4 plus a pi over 4, which is a pi over 2. And so our answer would be pi over 4. And so the average value of this function over this interval is pi over 4. That's the average.